What is up YouTube? I am trying to go down here and fish at the lake for a little bit, but it is a horrible day outside today. If you can see, we have about a one hour gap in between rain, um, but it is super windy. It is very overcast, but that's the only good thing is I'm hoping it's a little bit overcast. I'm hoping it might make the fish active for just a minute. Uh, we're not gonna have long to do this. I'm gonna try to go down here and start fishing a little bit. If nothing's going on here, I might try to hit the river on the way home, but I have a feeling it's gonna start, it's gonna start raining me out here in a little bit. And the problem with the rain is my camera or anything that I use isn't waterproof. But we'll go down here and try and we'll see what we can do. Hopefully we can catch something. If not, then you'll just get a little short video of me not catching any fish again. So let's get down here and do this little hike and see if we can catch anything. Well, a little windy today. Probably not gonna be down here very long. Wind's blowing. Yeah, this is gonna be about a five-minute trip. I mean, there's white caps out there. What am I thinking? I'm gonna throw this lipless crankbait out here and uh, just see. Uh, I'm not gonna spend much time down here. I can't even bring it up here without the wind catching it. I should have checked the, uh, what the wind was doing before I came up here. Usually I do, but I got excited it quit raining for 10, for 10 minutes. One more. I don't know why I'm pulling it again and then we're going to get out of here. Yeah. Scratch the lake idea. I tried. So I come back up here, my tire is way flat and I hear something, we have this. This is gonna cut my fish in shore. I gotta get out of here before I'm a flat and get stuck up here. So we're gonna go deal with this. So stay tuned and let's see if I get off this, um, see if I get out of here. All right, so this fishing trip has turned into a, we gotta get the tire fixed quick. Um, I think Walmart plugs tires. We're probably gonna have to try to go there, but I gotta get away from where I'm at back down towards into town a little bit. We are at 15 PSI, dropping quick. I don't know if we're gonna be fishing much on this vlog, but let me go try to get this tire fixed and then I'll let you know. So, hang tight. All right, so yeah, that was gonna be a three and a half hour wait just to get my tire plugged. Um, I'm not surprised, but I will say the guy was nice enough to let me put some air in my tire, and right now I pumped it up to 40 PSI, which I know is over. But we're going to see if it'll hold, and if it holds, we'll just get that fixed tomorrow or I'll do it later. I'm going to stop down here by the river and try this new lure that I picked up from Bass Pro yesterday. And just to see if we can do anything at all. Assuming my tire does not go flat by the time we leave there, we'll just worry about the tire tomorrow. So, alright, let's get down here to the river and see if I can get anything at all. Man, why if that river's hot? I don't know why it is, but it is. We're going to throw this. gonna have to put a spoon or something on here and throw it just to see I think I have one over here I can put on real quick oh, suckers old little Keo we're gonna throw it out there and just let it sink and right now and just let it kind of flutter on the way down see let it twerk on the way down get some of them trouts a little bit just let it twerk just let it twerk just let it twerk mm, they're digging the twerk i can tell you that much little son of a gun just came up and gave a little nibble on it like to twerk, do you? Let's twerk it some more. I don't have much time. Let's uh, first let's check on my tire. Oh, yeah, we're still good. Oh, yeah, we're good. Look at all that air in that tire. We're good for now, at least. Look, 
because I don't know if y'all know, I can catch fish anywhere. Huh. Why y'all keep gathering there? Y'all know something I don't know? Huh? Huh? A couple more times and I'm going to the house. The one right there. That's the one. I can feel it. No, that's the one. That's the one. Told you. Did he come off? Jesus. Did you see that? Really? I need to. I need to know if you guys have this kind of luck because the, if you've been watching any of my videos, they. I know he's popping up out of the water, but there's nothing more I can do. I even called that one. I called that one. 110% called that one. I said that's the one, and it was the one. I mean, the next one I get, I'm seriously gonna set the hook and then I'm gonna let him run. If anybody else out there has the kind of luck that I do, seriously, just tell me. In the comments below, just say yes, I feel your pain. Just checking on the tire again. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's holding up. Is that the... No. Screw. It's holding up. Maybe we can make it to my lunch break at work tomorrow, so we'll see. So the only thing that I'm thinking is whenever I set the hook, the fish comes out of the water, the line has a bunch of slack in it, the fish shakes, the hook comes out of its mouth, and I'll lose the fish. That has been the moral of the story since I started this YouTube channel. But I'm done fishing today. I'm going to have another video for you later on this week, and then I'm going to get talking about the Bass Pro Lures a little bit more. Thank you for watching. We will do it again. Lock down here at the bottom somewhere. Subscribe. It's going to be in this corner right here. Thank you, YouTube, for watching. I will see you next time. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you.